The N41 Million Non-Existing Youth Center Constituency Project by Hon. Mohamed Amar Jaga, a member representing Kebi Gwandu slash Alairo slash Jaga constituency at the House of Representatives, has been uncovered in Jaga, a local government in Kebi where the population is agrarian, with an area of 891 square kilometers and a population of 193,352. 2006 census. A visit by TRACA, the constituency project's tracking initiative of Bug IT, on April 23 could not trace the location of the said project. Calls and messages placed to Honorable Jaga to ascertain the state of the project were abortive, as he refused to respond to them. Apparently, the initiative, which ought to empower community youth, is a ghost project. The only center found in Jaga was that of people with disability. Emmanuel Ural, project tracking officer for Traca and Kebi, went to the Center for People with Disability to make inquiries about supply of equipment but discovered that there was nothing to show. This discovery was corroborated by the chairman of the Disability Center, Malam Dalhatu, who disclosed that there was no youth capacity development center in Jaya except the Center for People with Disability. He further said there was no supply of equipment or construction at the said center. Residents are not happy with the current development and they have registered their displeasure over non-implementation of the project, Dalhatu said. Traka's first visit to the community was on October 15, 2017 to hold a program sensitizing residents of about the N41 million project meant to furnish and equip a youth capacity development center in Jaga, Kebi State, which status was described as ongoing. Surprisingly, residents were not aware of the existence of the project neither could they ascertain the location, Yarrow added. Track distributed the 2017 budget publication showing that the project had been nominated. Also, inquiries at the local government constituency office of Honorable Jaga did not yield fruits, as the project location could still not be ascertained. Barristor Wong Jaga, a prominent member of the community, described the non-existence of the youth center as another instance of mismanagement of public funds. Lamenting that the project could have aided the empowerment of youth in the community with skills and reduced joblessness. He joined residents in demanding that Han Jaga should act in accordance with his promises to the community during the 2015 electioneering. This is the kind of problem a community suffers when their representatives refuse to carry residents along, he said. This problem is not only peculiar to Jaga community but it's national since our leaders sit in their Abuja offices and nominate projects without involving the masses. If you noticed, most of the projects initiated are not what the community desire. It's always a case of misplaced priorities. Adam and I love Bouj, team lead of Treka called Honorable Jaga on phone but the lawmaker dropped the call upon realizing that I left Bouj could not communicate in house it. Further calls, text messages and emails to him were not responded to as of the time of filing this report. Jaga's target achievement, as written on the National Assembly website, aims to reduce waste in government spending and leakages.